Hi everyone, I'm Jonathan Martin. And right now you're taking a live look at the solar eclipse. This close up view is from the Telescience Museum telescope. We are a little more than 30 minutes away now from the peak of the eclipse here in Georgia. We want to go right now live to our chief meteorologist, Chris Holcomb. He's again at the Telescience Museum in Cartersville. And I know Chris, people are all around you ready to watch this event. They really are, and where you saw that feed that we just showed you right now, um, we're in the observatory where that feed is coming from. I want to talk to someone right now. You just got to look into the telescope. Tell me what you saw, and why does this excite you? It was just amazing. I mean, you see a perfect crescent of the sun, and it's just, it's just really, really cool. It's a perfect crescent shape. All right. Thank you so much. We'll let you keep going that way, because I know people are wanting to come, to come, come in and out here. We have a crowd of people here uh, that are moving through, and the next one, y'all can come on by too. We don't want to stop them from seeing the view of this because we are getting close to maximum totality, not totality, but maximum eclipse coming up. We are just outside of the path of, of totality, but we do have a partial eclipse going on here. This again is a look at that live feed right now where you can see the moon covering up the sun. By the time we get to maximum eclipse coming up at about 304, this will be covering up about 80 to 85 percent of the sun. Now, here in Atlanta, we probably won't see it getting dark here uh, at maximum eclipse. There'll still be enough sun to keep it light. You may not even know what's going on if you didn't know there was eclipse happening. Then it'll be ending today at about 421 this afternoon. It'll be all over and then it'll just be a normal day coming up again. Again, you can see folks right now uh, that are looking through the uh, lens there of the telescope. We're able to see that live feed as well as looking at the folks who are, are looking through that lens right now. Let's go back to live and you can see what we're talking about there, where we do have a lot of folks here lining up on the stairway and uh, they are just waiting to get up here, hoping that they can time it out to see at Maximum Eclipse, Jonathan. It's really a fun day here in Cartersville. It sure is. Chris, thank you so much. And we're going to be checking back with Chris and also our crews at Stone Mountain Park. Live coverage continues today right here on 11 Alive News starting at 4.